I remember the first time I prayed with a friend. Somehow, he prayed what was already on my mind, something specific that only God knew I wanted to pray for. I thought, whoa, this is supernatural. How does that even happen? In Ephesians, one of the biblical letters written by a church leader named Paul, it says, there is one body and one spirit, just as you were called to the one hope of your calling, one Lord, one faith, one baptism, one God and Father of all, who is above all and through all and in all. Early in the letter, Paul suggests that the church, which is made up of all different people from different nations and backgrounds and cultures, are one movement, unified by Jesus. As a result of their faith, they are filled with the same Holy Spirit who binds people together in love and service to one another. Moments like I had with my friend where he could pray exactly what was on my mind are possible because the same Holy Spirit in my friend is the same Holy Spirit in me. And it's the same Holy Spirit in you too. For those of us who belong to Jesus and are desiring unity in our churches or families or friendships, God can bring people together. We serve one God and one Spirit and when we belong to Jesus, we belong to one another.